Hi, it's Marcus Terran here from Movitherm. And today I wanted to demonstrate real quick the FLIR A320 temp screen for elevated body temperature screening. Following the proper social distancing guidelines, uh, I'm wearing a mask today and standing away at least six feet from the cameraman and uh, essentially showing you what a temp screen camera can do for you. So you see my thermal image here um, in, the, in the video on screen from the, from the software that comes with the camera. And uh, the mask is not a problem, however my glasses are. You can see my glasses are extremely black, so the camera cannot see through glasses. So you need to tell people to remove their eyewear for screening because the exact um, temperature that is closely correlated to the inner core temperature of the body is down here in the inner tear duct area. So I'm looking at the camera and since I'm healthy, I don't have an elevated body temperature um, the software here shows a green frame and a green OK sign. And uh, what I'm going to be doing now is actually artificially warming up my tear duct areas and uh, I will be simulating an alarm situation. So now we have an alarm that you can clearly see. I have uh, heated up my tear duct and uh, the camera clearly detects this uh, rather rapidly. And you see a red frame in the image and uh, the warm button. The way you set up the FLIR A320 temp screen camera is by building a baseline population. For that, you take 10 individuals with a known good body temperature, present the individuals to the camera, snap their images, and build a population baseline by pressing the update reference button. And then you're ready to screen. Please make sure you click the like button and subscribe to our channel for any upcoming videos. And if you have any questions on the subject matter for elevated body temperature screening, make sure you leave your comments below.